How does an animal without fangs or claws survive a world of giant hyenas and saber-toothed cats? 3.3 million years ago, our ancestors were on the verge of extinction. They were small, slow, and defenseless. A single misstep was a death sentence. Then, on the shores of Lake Turkana in Kenya, a hominin, possibly an Australopithecus, did something new. It picked up a stone and intentionally struck it with another, executing a plan to create a sharp edge. The result was the Lomequi Toolkit, the oldest known manufactured objects on Earth. The makers of these tools may not have belonged to our genus Homo, but to Australopithecus, or possibly Kenyanthropus. This distinct Lomequian technology came hundreds of thousands of years before the Olduan tradition and marks a separate step in our technological evolution. This was not just tool use, it was the birth of technology. For the next 700,000 years, this technology barely advanced. Then, around 2.6 million years ago, the Olduan toolkit appeared. The Olduan tools represented a clear leap forward but appeared nearly half a million years after the earliest Lomequian stones. These were lighter, more precise stone flakes, created by a new species, Homo habilis, the handyman. These tools gave them a critical advantage. For the first time, they could slice through tough animal hides to butcher carcasses left by other predators. They could use hammer stones to crack open bones, and access the nutrient-rich marrow inside. This new diet, rich in calories and protein, fueled the growth of the most energy-demanding organ in the body, the brain.